I think there's something really special about playing in an orchestra. It's one of the only things I think that exists in the world where 80 to 100 people working together creatively, non-competitively, and it helped me become a person that I am now. I'm Danielle Kuhlman. I play the French horn. I'm an alum of the entire Seattle Youth Symphony program. And now I'm the fourth horn of the Seattle Symphony. What makes it so fun for me to be back in Seattle is being involved in the programs that helped me start when I was a young student. The Seattle Youth Symphony is a huge music program it spans many ages from you know, the elementary school age all the way into high school, into college even. It's a collection of amazing orchestras and educational programs that really just boosted Seattle's musical scene for years. My name's Soren Jones. I am 14 going on 15 years old. The instrument I play is the French horn. I was so excited when I got into Symphony. And it felt really good to be in a full orchestra. It was the first time I've ever been in an orchestra. My name is Joanne. Uh, my son is Soren. He started out playing trumpet and um, one day came home from school and he said, Mom, I want to switch to French horn. And I was a little surprised. What I like about the French horn is that it's, it's got more valves than a trumpet. It can be played really, really quietly, and it can also be played super loud and splatty and crazy. I don't know that Soren would have been introduced to the French horn if it had not been for the EIP program. EIP stands for the Endangered Instruments Program, and this is a wonderful program that provides free music instruction for instruments that are less common, more rare, like bassoon, viola, French horn, tuba. Instruments that kids aren't going to pick necessarily right off the bat, but the instruments that you need to fill out an orchestra. EIP gives access to kids who might not normally seek out private lessons. When he first explained to me what this program was all about, the fact that the coaches are professional musicians and that they come to the schools, I was amazed. So my introduction to the French horn actually is also EIP related. I was playing the flute at Washington Middle School. Through the EIP program, I switched to French horn because I was able to get coachings and lessons at school. I love it so much. I can't imagine having played anything else. So it was kind of amazing that I came to it almost by chance. It's given him some confidence, like an anchor. You know, everybody has some special talent that they sort of need to hang on to and feel good about themselves, and I, and I feel like this is giving it to him. There are all these other kids that are at my level, in my experience, and they're, and they're really nice kids, too. They're, they're, they're all loyal and kind. I feel inspired by a lot of the students I'm working with. French horn is a very difficult instrument, so I have a lot of respect for the kids who are, who are taking on that challenge. John was actually part of the reason that I got involved coaching in EIP. John Karshney and I met in Symphonette uh, when we were in middle school. We had just both started through EIP, and then we actually both ended up at Garfield High School. And then we both ended up studying in New York, at different schools and um, in college, and then we somehow both ended up back in the Seattle Symphony, which this really does not happen very often. It's kind of like the way that sports teams work. Like no one's actually from the city they, they play in the orchestra with. So for John and I to both have made it into the symphony and for both of us to be coaches, to have made that professional journey together has been really cool. So earlier this season with Seattle Symphony, we did a side-by-side -side concert with the Youth Symphony. It was a lot of fun. 
A side-by-side -side performance is a performance where the students actually get to play side-by-side -side with some of the professionals and the coaches that they've been working with. I think the opportunity that uh, Soren has right now is amazing. It's such a great program and it's, it's great that it's available to any kid that goes to public schools. Well, in the future, maybe I could join one of those adult symphony things, like, or like one of those really famous ones. That's what I'm thinking. It's fun for me to sort of reflect and maybe see a little bit of myself in the younger students and wondering, you know, are these going to be the next generation of symphony musicians? To me, that's really special.